So guys, just grab a ball, small groups of four or five or six, chuck it around, have a bit of a play around. What we're going to look at for today's session, the outcome is confidence in contact with the ground and each other, and also develop those skills of catch, pass and evasion that we worked on before. Okay, we're going to start off with rugby netball. You're only allowed to hop now, lads. Lads, you're only allowed to hop to move. Hop only. Hop only. Okay, you change movement. You're allowed two-footed bounds now. Two-footed bounds. Oh, oh, that's not bound. Good follow-through. Is it Boona? Good follow-through on that. But next warm-up game is going to develop your confidence in contact and confidence with each other. It's called steal the sock. What we're looking to do, Ben is going to try and move around and evade, whilst Boona and Joe are looking to get one foot in close, head to the side, grab the sock, and pull it away. Boona and Joe win once they've got both socks off, Ben. You're only allowed in this small space here, Ben, okay? Ready with a quick demonstration for us? Go for it. Is it stay in the grid, stay in the grid, stay in the grid. Okay, hold it there, hold it there. Now, what were the two key points I said to you guys? One foot in close and head to the, head to the side. Brilliant, go. Well done. Good work, Joe. Come, Bunner. Good tracking, Bunner. Good tracking. Yeah, that'll do. Well done. <laughs> Good. Excellent. That's one. Keep going. Try and get the other one. Remember the feet. Oh, good footwork, lads. Good footwork. Get that foot in nice and close. Get that foot in nice and close. Head to the side. Yeah, well done. Brilliant. The next game we're going to play is called Pop Off Rugby. This one is developing your confidence in contact with the ground. So we're going to teach you how to fall safely to the ground. So guys, now let's talk a little bit more about how we're hitting the floor here. So we'll be trying to fall knee, then hip, then shoulder before you let the ball touch the floor. So don't put your arm out just when you're ready. How do we feel about that, guys? A bit more controlled, less chance of injury. What about the actual ball itself? Probably a little bit more controlled for looking after the ball, as, as well as being a lot safer than putting one hand out. Let's play. Touch there. Well done. Play the other way. Try and get a bit lower if we can. Touch there. Can we fall? So two-handed touch, on the two-handed touch, parachute to the floor. So you're looking at a first contact with knees, hips, back of shoulder, and then you can pop off. It's a two-handed touch game. You run forwards, you pass backwards. On a touch, you must parachute fall, fall to the floor, and then pop off. Well done, Jack, for keeping your arms in. Good hands. Brilliant go forward, well done. We're now going to look at the two on ones. Okay, you guys are going to work on everything we've done in the game so far in this skill zone. Okay, so there's two of you trying to beat this one defender. If the defender does manage to make a tackle, what are you going to do? Yeah, parachute fall like we've demonstrated and pop it up to our support player. Meanwhile, the defender is tracking back three metres. Hands up, excellent. Go forward, go forward, get back behind her. Tag there, so down. Good catch. Ready, off we go. Tag there, down we go. Pop it up. Good, excellent parachute pass. Coaching points. Tackler, make sure we're staying low. Attackers, make sure we're focusing on that pass. Okay, we're going to play overload touch. We're going to have a two-handed touch below the waist. Once you've had a two-handed touch below the waist, 
Again, it's going to be parachute fall, two hands on the ball, knees, hips, back of shoulder, pop off. Thank you. So blues, you're going to be playing that way to the blue try line. Reds, you're going to be playing to the black try line. Green bibs, you are permanent attackers, so you're always on the attacking team. Good specific comes, Ben. Oh, intercept and out, intercept and out. Well reacted. Well chased. Good hands. Oh, wait a minute. Good finish, good finish. Brian. Good talking, Joe. Oh, hello. <laughs> Today was about developing your confidence in contact with the floor and each other and developing your catch, pass and evasion skills.